Are virtual tours worth it? This is the topic of my video from today and you might have learned already that they get more and more popular and not only because of the, the current coronavirus situation, the corona situation, it has many other virtu virtual tours have many other benefits too. So in today's video I will give you some interesting stats about virtual tours, some use cases and further benefits for real estate professionals and also how you can make your real estate sales process a little bit more virtual or digital by the use of virtual tours. So let's jump right into the stats. 54% of buyers will not even look at a property unless it has virtual images. 87% of real estate listings get more views if they have virtual tours. And it keeps visitors, visitors, website visitors looking five to 10 times longer if real estate listings, real estate property listings have virtual tours. So you may, if you, are, if you are a real estate professional, you may know already about some of the disadvantages of a physical property tour because there is always the risk that there will be no shows, meaning that the client you have scheduled a, a property tour with just doesn't show up and without any notification. So the yes that's that's basically it and oh yes of course and what are virtual tours actually they allow basic they allow you basically to digitally tour a property similar to to google street view you may know already google street views where you can just look at a certain area just entering a certain address in, in Google Street View and you can look at the area in a, in a 360 degree view, turn around in all directions and you, you have an interactive screen here. So that's very similar to a property tour. You have basically Google Street Views inside of a property. So the benefits, what are the benefits? Sellers very often prefer now to work with realtors who offer virtual tours. Then it might also be able, it might be also possible to sell a property faster if the property listing has a virtual tour and it might improve the vacancy rate for rental properties. So you will find tenants faster. Now, how can you make your real estate sales process a little bit more virtual or digital by using virtual tours and i checked several websites several real estate real estate websites that offer virtual tours and i found that many of them don't use all the possible features that virtual tours are offering and by that leave money on the table for example if you are using a virtual tour and you look at the property and you can visit different um, different rooms the bathroom the bedroom and so on very often you don't see any text added you usually can add some labels which show the benefits in text form so you overlay the text is overlaid within the virtual tour and you can display some benefits and I didn't find any website that that does that so you basically leave a little bit money on the table and because if you would do this this could increase the conversion rate so very often no sales funnel is connected meaning that there is no call to action such as for example did you like this this tour make an offer for example so or, or contact us right now this is this is leaving money on the table a little bit 
except the physical tour, everything to date could be done virtually. For example, you look at a property online on a website, you schedule a showing with the agent, then you physically visit the property, you make the property tour, then you make an offer, then you, well, then you have the, the whole escrow process and close the property. Now with, <clears throat> now with virtual tours, you basically could take the whole real estate sales process online or, or virtual or digital by just adding, for example, the call to action at the end of a virtual tour, make an offer. So you basically can, you can avoid doing all those physical property tours. Of course, not everyone will be doing this, but I think you can reduce the amount of physical property tours by including incorporating virtual tours in the whole process. To recap, yes, I would say property, virtual property tours are worth it. You can use them as part of your real estate sales funnel by including also calls to call to actions. So visitors or potential customers can make an offer even already online. Many real estate professionals and, and websites don't use virtual tours to their full potential, which I don't understand why this is happening, but this is an opportunity. And basically you can, you can kill two birds with one shot. You can adapt to the Corona situation by, in, by including them and digitalize, digi, digitalize your real estate sales process. So that's it. I hope this video was helpful. Please subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so you get updated as soon as I have a new video out. Okay, thank you, bye bye.